Very oh, come on, oh, Jessica what? Rabbit. If you were going to write a song about your experience here at Miss Universe, what would you call it? I can't you know what, Steve? <laughs> Why are you scooching away from me? You don't love me? Uh, mm. Hey guys, it's Bob. And Doe, what is popping, y'all? Welcome back to our channel. Yes. For today's video, we yes. thought we would do a reaction to me because I'm a supermodel. Are you serious? And we're doing supermodels today. Well, I mean, she's not technically, well, technically she's so pretty she could be a supermodel, but I don't know. You tell me. Are Mrs. Universe's supermodels? Mrs.? <laughs> I mean, some of them might be married. I don't know. I don't know her business. Okay. Um, <laughs> anyways, that's what we're gonna be reacting to today. What year was this? 2018? Well, it's 2020 now, that's all I know. <laughs> 2020's Mrs. Universe pageant, I think, just happened. Shut up. Do y'all want us to watch that? And if so, put the links down below because I'm not exactly sure what you want us to react to. But before we do get into it, guys, make sure you click that subscribe button. Give us a like and a comment. Tell us what you like about the video. Tell us what you don't like about the video. Let us know. Also, even Instagram links down below in the description. Check us out on there, guys, because you might get a shout out from us. All you have to do is follow us on Instagram, like, and comment on this. So, that's the experience of the end of the video to see if you this video. Shout out. Also, we have a PO box. A PO box. Check it out. Check it out. Hold on. Hey guys, really quickly, before we get into the video, we just wanted to come on here and tell you guys that we have officially launched our Patreon. That's right, guys. We are starting a Patreon, and we are so excited about this, especially about our family reunion Zoom calls that are happening monthly, where we get to catch up, get to know you guys on a personal level by seeing you face-to-face -face and having active conversations with you guys. In one of our tiers, we're also offering personalized video reactions. But there's very limited space, so make sure you guys check it out. Link is down below in the description box. Oh my gosh, this do you one? see her? Girl, this did one? You? Yeah, it's that one. Yes. Yes. Yes, girl. Yes. I feel like, I'm sorry to pause it this quick, but I feel like this whole entire video. Yes, yes, yes queen. Yes. Someone should make a compilation of us saying, Yes! <laughs> wow, she's so pretty. A black belt at 12 years old. What? Now 24. This fashion model. She's 24. We're like 24, basically. Oh my You're kidding me. Oh, this makes me feel so bad. Oh my gosh. Look at how she walks. She walks like a freaking gazelle. Do you see those heels, girl? I would literally die. The Child Care Plus Center, a school offering free education to children. Philippines. Philippines. Wow. Okay, sis. Okay. We love that for you. Philippines. I'm still not over that she's 24, yo. From Africa and Asia Pacific. Philippines! Yeah, buddy. Okay. All right. Yeah, you act surprised. You already know you're going to win. I'm also, this is after the whole big thing with the Philip, the first. <laughs> wow. Do you, oh, do you hear how loud the crowd is? Yes, yes, I'm happy the Philippines loves me. Listen, you see what is Philippines and who? Um like like uh like Argentina? Brazil? Mexico? No, not Mexico. Mexico Venezuela? hasn't ran in a while. I do remember though, at one point, I think it was Mexico and Jamaica were the two in the top. Oh no way! I was so proud. Okay, so do you remember that iconic night? Girl, that, I remember everyone and their mother's mothers was watching that night. <laughs> I didn't 
see it. You did? I didn't see it, but I remember Chuchi texted me and was yeah. like, did you just see what happened? Yeah. Crazy. How long was that? This was before, no, this was after that too, which is why he said that. Right, I know, I don't know, but when was the other one? I thought that was like not even that long ago. I thought so too, but I mean, these years are going by so fast. Girl, That's can true. you believe we're at the end of November? I thought we were in the beginning. It's crazy. It's crazy. Okay, anyway. And a musician, if you were going to write a song about your experience here at Miss Universe, what would you call it? Uh, you, <laughs> you know what, Steve? As a Miss Philippines, I've always felt the love and the support of the Filipino people. And I think I brought half of my country here tonight. And so I would name the song Raise Your Flag because I stand here not as one, but as 104 million Oh, wow. That was perfect. Thank you, Her Philippine. answer. She's so good at this. The poorest areas of my country, I found that it was a lack of child support, not poverty, that killed their dreams. A child once told me, Kat, that's just not my life, and those dreams aren't meant for me. But I stand here today because someone believed in me, and we owe it to our children to believe in them. Kapong ka. Kapong ka. in the running is... She's so pretty, girl. Oh. Why are we shocked? Yeah. Why are we? Once I started the music, it just was fulfilling in a way that everything else wasn't. My mom told me that even when I was in the womb, like I was dancing along to music. I'm an only child, very, very close to my parents, especially my dad. He would always say the longest journey starts with a single step. When you have a dream or an ambition and it's so far away and it's so high up, you can feel overwhelmed. But when you look at it as just one step at a time, one day you're going to look up from your feet and you'll be at your destination. So that's a piece of advice from my dad that I feel I'm going to apply in my whole life. <laughs> what is she mixed with? Like, what is her dad? Philippine. I know. Is there like a specific... Girl, yes, Hill it, Queen. Okay, okay. I even love the. I didn't know we were doing the Victoria's Secret Angel Walk now. You right. right? Where's Tyra? I guess. Shiva. Hey. Do you see how even when she's walking, like her legs kind of? Yeah. Very. Specific. Oh, come on, oh, Jessica what? Rabbit. Oh my God. Wow. <laughs> the fierceness. God, how is she 24? I don't know, but I just feel really bad about myself right now, so <laughs> let's just pretend she's 30. <laughs> 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 Little thing. Uh... Yes, buddy. There's no way when you walk out with that dress compared to all the other women, no offense, but there's no way she's not gonna win. Do you see her? Yeah. Come on! I mean, come on! Come on! Uh, she's literally the only one. The in only red. one in red. This reminds me of um. You remember another Cinderella story with Selena Gomez? <laughs> Listen, you bring that movie up. <laughs> no, you in saying... every conversation that we have. No, it's usually the Hillary Duff one. I'm talking about the other one. Girl, <laughs> no, 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 no. You have to understand. We've had so many conversations, and she will always say that line. Have you ever seen that movie? Okay, but do you remember <laughs> Selena you know Gomez? About? When she puts out her leg, yes, you only say that the leg. Girl, she got invited to the white and black ball, and this girl pulled up in a red dress. <laughs> her character's name thinking and yeah okay i am so sorry but this is almost unfair if you look at these five women they're all beautiful i mean come on now puerto rico vietnam south africa venezuela nice they are all gorgeous okay they're gorgeous all of them but she's the only one in a red dress, so automatically, if you think about it, in terms of logic, your eyes just go to the one in the red dress. She stands out the most yeah. at this point, yeah. But you know what's so funny? Probably all four of those women were like, ooh, I know what's gonna dazzle them. I'm gonna be the one in the sparkly, yeah. <laughs> diamond-looking dress, and I'm gonna kill it. And then they all come in that same idea. Which one's your favorite dress? 
Not Catrionas? Yeah. Uh, Vietnam. Really? Yeah. I don't know. Actually, it's kind of blurry for me. I don't like this one. I don't like this one. I like these two. I have to. We have to remember oh. this is, means a lot, so. Oh, never mind. Okay. Yeah, now all of the dresses are gorgeous. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, all of these women, there's a reason why they are representing their country. They're just outstanding, right? In every way possible. Yes. Yes. Right. Uh, there's no buts. That's it. That's it. <laughs> yes. To take the Miss Universe crown is. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> you did that all alone. Thank you. Yeah, I did. Philippines, please join me. Why do they have to look? Oh, South Africa's gorgeous too. They're all so pretty. Congratulations. Look at his suit. Sorry, He's so I'm nervous. Busy. He's like, don't mess up with the Philippines this yeah. time. What is the most important lesson you've learned in your life, and how would you apply it to your time as Miss Universe? The most important. I work a lot in the slums of Tondo, Manila, and the life there is very. It's poor and it's very sad and I've always taught myself to look for the beauty in it, to look in the beauty in the faces of the children and to be grateful. And I would bring this aspect as a Miss Universe to see situations with a silver lining and to assess where I could give something, where I could provide something we as love. a spokesperson. And this I think if I could teach also people to be grateful, we could have an amazing world where negativity could not grow and foster and children would have a smile on their face. And we love a queen who's not only gorgeous, but intelligent. Thank okay? You. Yeah. That was a pretty good answer. Yeah. Every time you bring up children. Yeah, you get them. Oh Neo! Oh, we can't hear a song. Uh, Freaking YouTube, man. Yeah. Copyright infringement. Oh, oh. Okay, Neo. Almost up on her dress. Right? She looks like, girl. So pretty. Oh my gosh. Do you see her fierceness in her? That always makes me so nervous when they walk down. I always feel like they're gonna trip. Even, well, I mean, never mind. <laughs> Girl, the, the, the pose every time. Oh, yes! Come on. Yeah. Oh, my God. Come on. Do you see that? Do you that? see that? Okay. That was all right. <laughs> Whoever was her coach, you need to get a raise. I'm sure. Because they're like, they know how to make her stand out. Yeah. Literally. Like, come on. Center stage. South oh. Africa is gorgeous. Oh my god. Don't mess up. Yeah. Both right. of you have worked so hard to get here. But only one of you is about to become our new Miss Universe. If for any reason the winner is unable to fulfill her duties, the first runner-up will take her place. Good luck to you both. That must be so nerve-wracking. Like, I'm nervous. I know what happens. It's not even me. But it's just intense. The new Miss Universe I would be, like, squeezing is... the other's hand. Oh. Okay. Was, I'm sure Harvey was like, "Woo, thank God. Uh, let me look at that car one more time." Literally. Oh wow, she's beautiful too. Oh, she, she was the one before. I yeah. Guess. Wow, she's gorgeous. Take your first walk as Miss oh, put the crown good. That always makes me nervous too. Okay, there we go. Oh. Yeah, she's well deserving. 
Her name is so pretty too. Yeah. That's Fiona. Got Fiona. Aww. Watching stuff like this always reminds me of that movie with Sandra Bullock. Um, Miss Congeniality. <laughs> <laughs> Miss what? Miss Congeniality. Yeah, okay. Okay. So. So. Thoughts. Thoughts. Opinions. Opinions. Reactions. Um, go ahead, Lily. No, I list. actually go for it. Okay, I will. Catriona, you. Catriona. Catriona. Roll those R's, girl. How do you know they are in the Philippines? Because they were, I don't know if this is like a bad thing to say, but they were conquered by the Spanish for a while. So it's Catriona. Am I right? Watch everybody in the comments be like, no, though, you were so wrong and you just offended the whole entire country. Of the Philippines. Anyway, she is absolutely so gorgeous. And not only that, like, especially listening, always listening to when they ask them questions, it always, I always, like, don't want to listen to it, because I get so, like, especially after watching a couple where it's just been so bad, their answers. <laughs> and so then I get secondhand yeah. um, embarrassment or cringe. But no, she did so well in all of those uh, question and answer portions, too. So, yeah, good on Whoever you. Whoever her trainer is, you knew how to make her stand out. And that should be the person that trains everybody and maybe just like the person that heads Miss Universe in general. No. <laughs> yes. Bugs? No! Girl, I gotta change my wheel. Yay! It takes me 20 minutes. It's not my problem. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh, girl. What? The SIM card that's in this uh -oh. is my pastor's SIM card. <laughs> anyway, yes, that trainer knew every way to make her stand out from oh, yeah. her walk that looks like a freaking gazelle. And at this point. Sorry. Don't interrupt me. You went first for a reason. Her walk that was like a gazelle. And for this, that is a very good thing. Her pose, she slayed. Her demeanor. Her demeanor. Her stature. Her stature. Her, her dress. Being. Oh yeah. Her, her hair. <laughs> <laughs> Everything just killed it. She just knew how to stand out, so. Yeah. And she looked like Ruby Rose, and also from Catching Fire. Katniss? Yeah, kind of. I mean, it kind of had like that fire feel. Okay, all right. You know what I'm saying? Sure. I'm not making no sense. None. <laughs> anyway, it was beautiful. Yeah. She's gorgeous. Steve Harvey didn't mess up. That was great. Although, going back to when Steve Harvey messed up, I didn't watch it live. So I watched back when that happened, obviously, like half of the world. And then I got kind of obsessed. And so I watched a whole bunch of interviews with Pia. She's freaking hilarious. Oh, really? Oh my god, I love her so Aww. much. She's so, so funny. Anyways, if that was interesting to the video, here's this video's shout out. Thank you so much for following and for watching. We really appreciate you. Give us a shout out in our next video. Make sure to follow us, and we'll see you in the next one.